Hi, it's Hindi Chirwa with Channel 8 TV. It is Black History Month in 2016. In the studio today, I have the privilege of interviewing Miss Black Washington. Welcome to the program. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Thank you for being here. First question. What is Miss Black Washington USA? Miss Black Washington USA is a branch of the Miss Black USA pageant system and it is the premier pageant for women of color so it gives women specifically like me a platform to stand on to uh, contribute to our communities to bring awareness to the causes that are important to us and it uh, gives me the opportunity to work with the community and get involved with mentoring and getting involved with our youth as well so it's a great platform for me. What is your platform for this year? My platform for 2016 is Operation Transcend, and Operation Transcend is my own nonprofit organization that I'm building. Um, and what it is, it is a, a series of programs with a curriculum that's based on um, helping our youth reprogram the patterns of negative thinking that they have adopted, and, and unfortunately, our community has adopted, and we pass down from generation to generation unknowingly. So, uh, it's a platform uh, for me to get that out there and help uh, us get our minds right and, and get them in the right area where they need to. Be. What does Black History Month mean to you? Oh, Black History Month is something that's very important to me and I've always held very near and dear to my heart. Um, it means a lot to me because it gives me the opportunity to reflect on what my ancestors have done and uh, really the way that they've paved um, to provide me the opportunity to even sit here. This pageant system itself was created out of necessity because we were once not allowed to participate in traditional pageant systems. So just like, you know, black folks were the best at taking lemons and making the sweetest lemonade. We created this system just like uh, many others that uh, help our communities and bring awareness to issues that transcend color as well. So uh, Black History Month to me is, um, it, it's something that's so near and dear to me and um, I'm just so grateful to everyone that's paved the way uh, for me to be here today. What do you do for the community? Oh, I do a ton for the community. Um, I love getting involved. I um, mentor with, with the Life Enrichment Group here in Seattle, Washington. Um, and through that, I mentor and I attend community events. Um, I also, uh, I love volunteering with the True Font Family Foundation, uh, which is a um, foundation here that's based in uh, Seattle, Washington as well. Uh, they put on community events all the time that help uh, ask at risk youth, and, and that's exactly what the Life Enrichment group does as well so um, I, I get involved that way um, and I, I just I talk I like to visit schools I, I visited Alki Elementary a few weeks ago and that was great to do as well so it gives me the opportunity to get out there and get involved what do you do for kids Oh, well, along with my mentoring um, and my nonprofit which of course is foster and at-risk youth based um, I really want to encourage them with my actions that um, that it is possible to be whatever you want to be. So I think that just with my mentoring and um, being that example, I'm showing that um, anything is possible and um, you don't have to confide to the box that people try to put you in. So uh, I think that's what I do for kids. What is your advice for kids that are entering pageantry? Um, have fun. Be yourself. Um, I would advise kids to be the best version of themselves that they could be. Um, each of them has that own, you know, that that gift, that vibration that only they give off themselves, and um, only that only they can bless us with. So, I would encourage young ladies um, to be themselves, to smile, to be kind, to focus on their educations in school, and really focus on being that change and being the best version of that change that you can be. What are your last words? Um, my last words for my community. Um, I would say that uh, these are definitely trying times for us um, and I would encourage you all to focus on being that change you know be that example of goodness that we're all looking for we're all looking for that answer we're all looking for that outlet that that rescue um, and I, I think that a lot of us need to just focus on being that within ourselves be that example show us show our youth and and show your kids and show your friends and family that it is possible to be a good person and to be that change that our community so desperately needs. So um, that's what I would encourage my community to do. And I would also encourage them to uh, follow me on social media. Um, you can stay up to date with my journey as Miss Black Washington USA 2016 on Facebook um, at Miss Black Washington USA 2016, on Instagram at Miss Black Washington USA, on Twitter at Devon, and you can follow me 
uh, oh, sorry, I forgot that last one. <laughs> um, my last social media. Um, um, and I'm also on LinkedIn at Devon Williams. So keep up with me. I have a lot of great things coming up for you all this year. Thank you for being here today. Thank you for having me. There you have it. This is Tandy Cheerwell with Channel ATV. Thank you for watching. Your life matters. What about freedom? What about teaching something more than all?